Japan, that's what they call me. I promise that you Alright, guys, uh, now today is the second week of school. So today is Monday, and, you know, since, mo since it's Monday today, you know, it's digital filmmaking class today. But for right now, I'm having a uh, breakfast, English muffin. And, uh, yeah, so after that, I'll be, you know, brushing my teeth, heading to the shower, get dressed, and then, you know, I'll be coming back downstairs to have lunch. So see you later. Alright, I'm all cleaned up, all dressed up, and now it's time for lunch. Lunch for the day. I'm gonna enjoy my lunch, and then I'll be heading to the JC. Okay, so I just finished my digital filmmaking class, which was uh, pretty fun today. I mean, we didn't do much. I mean, all we did was, you know, uh, the class and I were, you know, getting together and then just explain about our, you know, our two two pitches for, you know, the short some of our short films that we might, you know, that we're thinking thinking of the film, and that's just pretty much it. All right, guys. So it's Tuesday morning. Having this. Uh breakfast sandwich for breakfast. Okay, so we're ending our English 1A right now, but uh, we're just having our 20 minute break, you know, to get our, you know, to have our English 50 get started, which is over there in the computer lab. For right now, for break time, I think it's uh, Switch, Nintendo Switch time, you know. I'm gonna play my Nintendo Switch for a bit. Okay, so I just finished my English 50 class in the computer lab, but uh, they have like so right now I'm in the middle of the campus where they have like a basketball hoop that you can just play around. One shot just for you guys, all right? Let's see. Okay, one hand in. Oh my god, oh, 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 that was close. At least I tried. It's just, just one shot. All right, now I'm back home and this is just my lunch for today. Yeah, I'm gonna enjoy my lunch and then after that, I'm gonna do some work and then I'll see you tomorrow for uh, digital filmmaking on Wednesday. All right, good morning again. Doing, having some breakfast, bagels and cream cheese, and uh, I'm about to put this uh, cream cheese back in the refrigerator. Also, just watching TV, Fox Sports 1, watching uh, Skip and Shannon, the, like I always do every morning. You know, they're, they're awesome. Hey, all right, we got Colin Cowherd here. He's awesome too. All right guys, so now I'm all dressed up and all clean up, already showered and brushed my teeth and got dressed. And now the lunch for today. Let's see if you can see it, there it is. Gonna enjoy my lunch and then after that, we'll head straight to the JC. Who I ran up to? Oh, you're vlogging right now? Yeah, why? Oh my God. Ah, nice. Oh, okay, it's fine. Alright guys, time for another basketball shot of the day. Let's see if we can make it this time. And oh my oh, oh well, so that was close, but maybe next time. <laughs> Alright, so that's the end of my digital filmmaking class and it was great. You know, we finished the, you know, everybody to share their pitches for their short films that they wanna you know, that they wanna write. So uh I'm about to do some work. And uh I'll see you tomorrow morning for uh, English. Uh, so it's Thursday now and I got scrambled eggs for breakfast. Lovely. Ah, uh, ran right up to these Jesus guys today. Christ. No, no. This guy is talking about harvesting people's heads. What? In Minecraft, because oh, he's playing his own server with us, and I'm just telling Wait, him. are you playing my- oh no, there's no, <laughs> nothing on the computer. Chrome, but you think I can play Minecraft? <laughs> <laughs> there's nothing on the computer right now. How's your day been going so far? Oh, it's good, it's got all collapse. Oh yeah, I did too. What time is it? Uh, it is, uh... I like how you bring the Switch with you just until the time. <laughs> Wait, don't you have a phone? Huh? He is using his phone. Yeah. Yeah, right here. Phone, right? time. Oh, Ryan, it's good to see you. It's good to see you too, sir. Yeah. How's your day been going? We're going great. Nice. How's your day? Oh, so far it's been doing good. What class do you have? Uh, English. I just had English too. Ah, uh, nice. Here we go. Seven.
Oh no, does this mean I can't do the shot of the day today? Because there's no basketball here. Did somebody stole the basketball again? Because this this literally happened last week. <laughs> Alright, we're here at having some lunch at Chunky's. You know, I got the uh, taco plate. You know, I got two tacos, a uh, salad here, rice, and some beans. Yeah, this, this looks really good. Can't wait to eat this. Just ended my lunch break, which is delicious. Now I made a Starbucks run last week. Ra Oakland Raiders player, Antonio Brown. He was like the most talked about player last week, all because uh, of a football helmet situation. Raiders want wanted him to wear one of his old helmets, I think. And then Antonio says, you know, says no, he refused it. You know, he refused to do that. He wants to wear the new helmet. So then this week, I mean, let's see, he wasn't, he wasn't in training camp for like, I don't know, probably like a week. I can't remember. But then this, but then this week he came back to training camp just, uh, and then started to wear a helmet, but it's a certified helmet for the Raiders. Well, that was according to Raiders coach John Gruden. But they said that he did wear a helmet. Ezekiel Elliott, the Cowboy, Dallas Cowboys player. They, he was most talked about NFL player last week as well. Jerry Jones, who's the manager, the president, and the owner of the team. Uh, he was like joking around when a reporter asked him, asked a question about him well, by saying his nickname, Zeke. That's Ezekiel Elliott's nickname because, you know, Zeke is short for Ezekiel. And then, and then Jerry Jones was joking, joking around by saying Zeke. And then, you know, the reporters are laughing, Jerry was laughing, but then Ezekiel Elliott didn't, didn't appreciate the joke, which I'm, I'm just like, really? Andrew Luck, the Indianapolis Colts quarterback, is retiring. And, well, retiring at the age of 29, and I was shocked. I was really shocked when I heard about it. I think I think it was I first heard about it during the weekend. I think and I was surprised. And then there was like a video of the Indianapolis Colts fans booing Andrew Luck for, you know, making his decision to retire. And that I didn't expect either. I didn't expect the fans uh, booing for his decision. I mean, come on, guys. To the Colts fans out there, you know, if Andrew Luck wants to retire, then ha let him retire. I mean, it's his, it's his decision. Like Rob Gronkowski, the uh, Patriots, uh, I can't remember if he plays wide receiver or tight end, but he's retiring too. But then all of a sudden, out of nowhere, he has, he's been thinking about coming back to the NFL, which I'm, I'm not going to complain about it. Like, I'm not mad about it, you know. I'm not his boss or his agent, but, you know, he's thinking about coming back but so far he wants to rest for a while my my dad told me that he read an article that you know since Andrew Luck will not be with the Colts they all the Colts are thinking about getting guess who Colin Kaepernick really Colin Kaepernick subscribe my channel if you haven't subscribed yet and see you next video peace